we're back for another Dokkan battle video and today we'll be testing out AGL Tapion in the God of Destruction event. I'm going to try him out on actually as many stages as possible. Uh, unfortunately I could not build a super AGL based or just an AGL based general generalized movie heroes team so we will not be able to test out Tapion in a type advantage scenario which is against what Rumshi and you know, let me pull it up. Who's the other STR God of Destruction? It's Rumshi from Universe 10. And then... Who is it? Oh, yeah. The God of Destruction for Universe 1. Uh, Iwan or Iwan, right? Whatever his name is. So we're going to try Tapen out under a movie boss slash full power team. Type neutral. Uh, he's going up against an int enemy. This is, of course, a double physical DBS Broly lead, uh, which is attack 170 and HP and defense 150 so my intention is to link him up with Tech Golden Freezer he'll be coming back on this rotation at turn number three so I can use items if necessary next rotation uh, we'll just let Tapion have a look here so we won't be able to get a super attack but that's fine I presume we're dead just because DBS Broly is going to take a lot of damage but let's see 21k like okay that's honestly that could be worse like I feel like a lot of physical units or you know a lot of type other type neutral units will take a lot of damage so it's taking 20k per hit so i should have, i think another thing i forgot to show you guys was well link levels uh, and dupe system investment he's 69 percent of the dupe system um link levels aren't too great oh wow i'm probably taking 58k as long as this guy doesn't super attack we can heal uh next turn and then we should be good from there Okay, uh, so I make a cut here, and we'll come back when Tapion's on rotation. Okay, so we're back on rotation with Tech Golden Freezer. We share revival and fierce battle with him. I'll also go ahead and show you dupe system investment. There he is. He has a level five bronze attack equip on him as well, and his links are ranging from six to eight. Unfortunately, we couldn't actually bring AGL Golden Freezer because Dokkan stupidly have banned any like um, nuking type leader skills. Uh, but you know, like they could have just banned uh, banned him from being used as a leader, right? So we'll give Tapion these AGL orbs here. Golden Freezer should be good, um, even though he has type disadvantage. Actually, wait, no, forty-four. Okay, <laughs> forty-four thousand uh, as defense isn't too great. Uh, let's see. Hopefully, Tap Tapion can take a super attack. That'd be good. So it's at one point seven. Not really interested too much in his damage anyway. It's pretty much his tanking capabilities. Okay, so we got to dodge. Please super attack me. Please super attack me. Please. Okay. That's fine. Um, hopefully we can survive this turn and I can then use another item next rotation. And then we can see maybe one more rotation with tape on it. Okay, so Tech Golden Freeze is taking 22k as well. He did actually super attack last rotation. So I'm, we're going to make a cut here. Hopefully he can survive this DBS Broly. Okay, so I have to jump back into the stage here. Um, you probably won't even see this rotation uh, if Tapion does not take a super attack. So I am interested at this point in just seeing how well he takes a super attack. Uh, we've seen that he takes 20k from normals. So, okay, here we go. This is amazing. Okay, this is exactly what I wanted. 228. Okay, so that's still a lot of damage, but him taking 20ks on, on type neutrality, normal attacks, I think that's, that's honestly serviceable, right? At this point, what I'm going to do is just hop into a... AGL God of Destruction with a revived Warriors team led by Margin Vegeta and again it'll be another type neut type neutral scenario so yeah we'll, uh, we'll make a cut and we'll jump back in okay we are back against the God of Destruction for Universe 11 what's his name like Belmard of the Muth the clown basically. Um, I'm actually going to float Tapion off because I want him to link along with Tech Ultimate Gohan. His defensive levels are actually the same um, on this team as opposed to the team that we just looked at him on, which is, of course was Moogle Bosses slash Full Power. This team we have 150% to all stats because Vegeta gives 150 3 key to all revived warriors, whereas for Super Saiyan 2 category allies he gives 3 key and 170 to all stats. So we're going to have. Tapion floating here. We'll give that to Golden Freezer. Vegeta doesn't really need a super attack, I don't think. Um, 
Should I? I mean, it doesn't... We'll give him one anyway, right? Because he'll do more damage than Tapion. I don't really need Tapion to get a super attack off anyway. Hopefully, Golden... I mean, Golden Freezer should be fine. Uh, his damage reduction is very, very high. He also has type advantage here, so he should be good even with that... Yeah, even with his defense being lowered, he's still taking like 5,000, 6,000 damage. So, let's see how well Tapion does. I presume he'll take similar damage levels to what he was taking in the previous God of Destruction stage, which was, what, 20k? By the way, this took me ages to recall or to find a Vegeta friend lead, right? 27, okay, so he's taking a bit more, okay? So I will jump back in to the next rotation with Tapion on. We'll hop back in. We'll, we'll come back when Tapion is on rotation again. Okay, we are back with turn number 5. So we have Tapion now linked with the GOAT, Tech Ultimate Gohan. They share three links. Uh, those three links being Brainiacs, Revival, and then Fierce Battle. Um, I know Revival gives two key and a certain amount of attack and defense and HP regeneration under 50% health, but I'm not sure exactly what it is. Uh, Brainiacs does give attack and defense 14%. Uh, of course, I believe at link level 10, it's... Uh, is it 20% or 50? I think it's 15%. Yeah, 15%. Um, oh, just clicking all over the place here. And we have this revival, so yeah, under 50% health, it gives me 3.5% attack and defense, as well as 2% health recovery. I believe at le link level 10, that's 5% attack and defense, and um, I think it's, f is it 5%? I think it's 5% health recovery. And then Fierce Battle, of course, is just giving me 18.5% attack. So, Tapion's defense here is 106k, that's the highest that we've seen so far. We're going to have him in slot 1, just because that is where majority of the attacks are based, and I we don't need to see how well Tech, Tech Ultimate Gohan will tank, right? Um, so yeah, let's just see how this plays out. Hopefully, Belmard can give me a super, not frame one. Okay, that's fine. 13k, that's pretty impressive. Yeah, because the, 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 the thing to think about is, my Tapion isn't link level 10, he's not rainbow. Um, he's only one dupe and he's, you know, fairly link level, but that's... Yeah, that's pretty good, man. Tapion is impressing me so far. Um, we'll make another cut here, hopefully we can come back with another rotation, and then we can see if Belmard will want a super Tapion. Another, actually, I suppose I should say, a little side note is I'm actually really impressed with Demon King Piccolo as well. As long as he's able to grab the five rainbow orbs, this man's defense, like, you know, he can actually get very high in terms of his damage reduction. <laughs> my, my voice just broke, but damage reduction, right? But yeah, we'll make a cut and we'll return when Tapion comes back. Alright, so we are back. Now, something is telling me that he will super attack in slot two. You know, it could be the bajillion number of attacks he's about to perform or something, but... Yeah, I have a feeling he will super attack in slot 2, so we'll put Tapion in slot number 2 here. Uh, 231k defense for Gohan, and then 106 for Tapion. Hopefully, uh, he will super attack Belmont in slot number 2. 2.8 from Gohan. Yo, Gohan is just... he's out here, right? He's just one-man army. Like, he's, he's too good. Okay, this is good so far. 1.7 from Tapion. Yeah, so his attack stat again, not too great. We just need that tech Tapion easier, right? And that would be really good for this guy. 11k. Alright, okay, here we go. This will be a good test. Hopefully he doesn't dodge. 266, so that's a lot. And now, yeah, he's taking 55k. Um, here's the thing. Vermouth is probably... Vermouth Belmont is probably the strongest God of Destruction that we currently have. Him just lowering defense is crazy. And as you saw, Tapion went from 11k uh, with normals to 50k. I don't know. Like, he, he's, he's still... I think... I. His, I can't even speak. I still think he's very good for this event. Um, especially since he's an unfeatured SSR, right? He's a banner unit, per se, in the unfeatured pool. So it stands to reason that a lot of people will probably have him with at least another dupe than me. And on Global, that I have him Rainbow, right? Uh, I don't... I think at Rainbow, after that super attack, he probably would be taking... What, like 35k? 40k at max? And that's still very impressive for a unit who's type neutral. And... Yeah, I mean, he, uh, here's the thing. Don't let that super attack discourage you. I think he's still very good. He can still be used on like a, a few other categories as well. I, I presume you could probably run him under the STR Bojack Time Travel slash Revived Warriors since Bojack is good enough. And Tapion so far seems to be strong enough for um, type neutral God of Destruction bosses, right? So, I mean, that'll conclude the Tapion showcase. I could run him in a physical boss, right? We could run him against Sidra or Moscow, but I think that we've seen all that we've needed to see. I don't think he'd take more than 30k. 
at my current new system level, so let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.